Hello everyone, so the video that you're about to see is my first weekly vlog. I vlogged throughout the entire week because I just wanted to share a little bit about my week with all of you. And before I get into the video, I just want to say a couple of things. The first thing is that yes, I am wearing a hat and that is because my hair is really messed up because I've been really busy today. The second thing I want to do is wish a very happy Father's Day to any dads out there who are watching this, especially my dad because I know that he's watching this video. He watches all of my videos, so thank you so much dad for being so supportive and so amazing. The next thing that I want to say is that I would really appreciate it if you would watch the last video that I uploaded, the one right before this one, because I talk about a lot of important things in it and I honestly think that it's one of the most important videos that I've ever made on this channel, so please go check that out. So that's all I want to say for now, so let's get into my week. Hello everyone, so I'm at my new house. I'm actually here alone because my dad just left and the reason that I'm here at my new house is because this is a lot closer to the company that I'm going to be working at starting tomorrow. So I decided that I would stay here to make my commute a little bit easier. It's about 8.45, there's no Wi-Fi, and there's no one here to talk to, so I thought that I would just make a video and give you guys a little bit of a house tour. So this is the front door. It's very tall, all of these doors are really tall. And there are my shoes over there. And then this is what it looks like when you first walk into the front door. It's chandelier, there'll be some furniture here. Then the stairs are over here. And then there's a guest bathroom right here, so if you ever end up visiting this house, you'll probably use this bathroom. And then there's the closet under the stairs. We'll probably keep some coats and maybe some other stuff in here, but it's very Harry Potter-like. And then there's the laundry room. It's quite big, and there's also a sink over here. Okay, so now we're back in the room with the chandelier, and if you keep walking, Forwards, you'll see the biggest room and this has another chandelier and we'll probably put a kitchen table somewhere over here and some other stuff over here. This is the kitchen. There are a lot of cabinets. There are also a lot of outlets which is very good for cooking things. There's a stove and an oven and also a pretty big sink and a dishwasher. And then this is the pantry. I don't think I've ever had a walk-in pantry before even though I've lived in so many houses over the years. This is the refrigerator. Looks pretty cool and uh, all it has in it is two bottles of water for me to drink. And then if you walk past the kitchen on the left is the guest room. There's a big bathroom for the guests that has a shower, although you will notice that there isn't a shower head in there at all. And this is the guest room. It's just a pretty simple room with a big closet. And then there's the backyard. It's a little bit dark out right now, so I don't know how much you'll be able to see, but this is the yard. There's a nice green lawn and a lot of fruit trees over here. And there's actually a lemon already growing on this tree. And then there's a few trees over here. And then the air conditioning is right up against the side of the house. And I'm very excited about the air conditioning because it's probably going to be pretty hot this summer. Okay, so next I'm going to take you guys upstairs. And there's a chandelier above the stairs, but it's not turned on right now. On the right is another laundry room. Don't really know why there's two. And then the next room right here is my brother's room. Has a big window closet and then it has its own bathroom. And then here is my room and then I have a little bed set up right here. I will be bringing my regular bed here um, but we're waiting for movers to move that. And if you saw the video I made about my new YouTube setup, my bed was in that so that bed will be going here. I'll probably have my desk right here and, and then this will be my studio wall. And then there's my closet. It only has my clothes for tomorrow in it but it will eventually be filled with all of my clothes. And then this is my bathroom. I have a garbage bag here because there aren't any trash cans yet. And this is the toilet and the shower. It's pretty big. This is my sink area. It's already kind of a mess. And then this is me recording the video right now. And the last room is the master bedroom. It has two doors, which is pretty cool. And uh, this is what it looks like. It has a really big closet can actually walk around this corner and then it has this whole other area over here. And then this is the bathroom. There's a bathtub with 
jets in it, which is pretty cool, and a shower, and then a toilet right here. So that was my house. I hope you guys liked it. I'll probably continue this vlog tomorrow because it's my first day of work, and I'm also going to try to go to the DMV to get my address changed on my ID and to update my voter registration. And I also might be going to Ikea to get a new desk. Good morning everyone, so I'm just waiting for the bus right now so that I can head to my first day of work. This is what I'm wearing today. Blue shirt, gray sweater, and I have black pants and black shoes. Since last night was my first night in my new house, I don't really know what this bus route is like or how long it's going to take, so it's actually about 6.15 right now. Hello everyone, so I just finished work and I'm waiting for the bus right now to go to my favorite place in the entire world, the Department of Motor Vehicles, to get the address changed on my ID and to update my voter registration. And I was actually there in October of last year. This particular DMV wasn't that bad. I was able to get in and out in less than an hour, so hopefully that will happen this time. But work went pretty well. Everybody was really nice. I just finished up at the DMV. It took more than an hour, but at least I got my address changed on Hello everyone, so I've actually been working on my room a little bit these past few hours and uh, this is what it looks like. This is my bathroom. You can see the very colorful curtains here. And then I have all of these boxes and some of my favorite books on the shelves here. And then uh, this is my bed right here. It's very nice. It has a leaf covering over it. I'm just joking guys, I'm actually in Ikea right now. So I found a desk that I like and I think it's pretty cool. This one right here. But I want to get it in the black color like this. Hello everyone, so it is actually the next day. We got back to the new house from Ikea pretty late last night. So I didn't end up having the time to show you guys the stuff that we bought. But I do have the time today, so I'm going to show it to you right now. A lot of it is still in boxes and we haven't built it yet. So the first and most important thing that we got was my new desk and it's in those boxes over there. The next thing we got are the slippers that I'm wearing right now on my feet. The next thing we got was this mirror which is right here in this box. So the next thing that I got was this uh, mirror. Looks like this. The next thing I got were these two packs of wooden hangers. All of my hangers are really mismatched and they just look terrible. So I decided to get some of these because I already have some of these and I really like them. That was everything that I picked out, but my dad picked out a couple things, so I guess I'll show you guys those as well. He got these three things. Our showers are pretty much all glass, so I think these are for cleaning those or something. And then he also got this uh, step stool. It's pretty high. It's probably about a foot off the ground. So that's everything we got at Ikea. Hello everyone. So it is Friday now, and I'm at work really early because the bus broke down. So I took an Uber and now I can't even get into the building for a few more minutes. But I'm very, very thankful that Uber exists because now I've maintained my reputation of never being late and it only cost me $6.55. So thank you to Thomas from Uber if you're watching this. Hello everyone, so I just got done with my first week of work and I'm at Pam Mountain View right now because my dad is getting a colonoscopy, but it was a good day at work. It was really busy. We worked on iPads and put skins and cases on them and put cases on two pallets of MacBook Airs and packaged those all up to be shipped. So we did a lot today. It was busy. It was a little bit hectic, but I'm really proud of the work that we did and I'm so glad that I decided to work at Mac to School. It's an awesome company and the people there are so nice and so awesome and we even got to have cake today. We had burnt almond cake, which I've never had before, but it was absolutely amazing. Okay, so we are at PAMP now, and my dad is right here. Is there anything you want to say? Um, congratulations for modern medicine. Thank you. <laughs> so how did it go? Well, I had a colonoscopy today. I recommend everybody do it. It's really good for preventing um, cancer. And uh, it's very easy and painless and straightforward, so go do it. So how long did it take? It takes like 20 minutes, 15, 20 minutes. It's really quick. How long have you been here for? I arrived here at 12.45. Could that be right? Yes. Do you want to tell the people about the liquids you had to drink yesterday, or would you rather forget that? <laughs> 
Um, let's not go into that. Hello everyone, so we just stopped by the new house and uh, we're going out for dinner and guess who's driving? Hello. So I'm working on my lab for geology and it says it's supposed to look like icing or cake frosting and I don't really know if this is correct so hopefully it is. So the instructions said to take the two pieces of styrofoam out of the pie tin and I took them out and they look like a really weird sort of ice cream sandwich. So it's Saturday afternoon now and I think I'm going to end the video. I ended up finishing all of my geology work and anthropology work. There was so much of it, but I ended up getting it done before the deadline, so that's really good. So as far as moving goes, the movers are actually coming to move our beds on Wednesday. So I will be doing another weekly vlog next week showing you guys everything that's going on with the move. But I will hopefully have another video up before that. So if you have anything that you want me to talk about in that video, feel free to comment down below. I have a lot of videos that I want to make written down on my phone. But if you guys have a lot of questions for me or want me to talk about a bunch of different topics, I can totally do that. So let me know if you have any questions about moving or my new job or my haircut or anything like that and I'll probably answer them in a video next week. This week has been pretty hectic and there have been a lot of things going on and a lot of changes in my life but overall I'm very happy this was one of the best weeks that I've had in a really long time so that's everything that I wanted to say in this video I hope you all have an amazing rest of your father's day and I'll see you all very soon with a new video goodbye